From the students of the Department of Meteorology and Atmospheric Science, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Happy Friday evening, State College. I'm student meteorologist Daniel Weaver with your CNET Friday evening forecast. If we start our evening forecast with a nice view outside of Beaver Stadium, no clouds at all in the sky. Mr. Sun is finally back out today, and we are sitting at a temperature of 66 degrees this afternoon with a dew point of 43 degrees. So I feel a little dry out there, but not too bad, right about where we should be for average in terms of temperatures. For your headlines this weekend and into next week, well, we're going to warm those temperatures up a bit this weekend, maybe seeing some highs in the 70s, definitely on Sunday, maybe on tomorrow we'll see some highs in the 70s. And speaking of Sunday, the rain is back for Sunday, but then after that, once the rain moves out, the fall weather comes in, the temperatures drop, and we'll actually see highs in the 50s for next week. So feeling a little chilly for your next week. Speaking of chilly temperatures and dew points, it is not feeling chilly right now with a bunch of sixes across the central Pennsylvania. And if we zoom out across the state too, temperatures are still in the 60s with the only exception being Johnstown sitting at 59 degrees. And those dew points are in the 40s too. So feeling a little dry, but not too bad. At least it's not feeling humid either. And temperatures though, they are quite a bit warmer than where we were yesterday. Look at that, Erie sitting at 14 degrees warmer than where we were 24 hours ago. Pittsburgh at 6, and Philadelphia also at 6 degrees warmer than yesterday. Speaking of warm, it's going to be warm down there in South Carolina. Great day for the football game. You might have a few crowds out there for the tailgating, but otherwise, Mr. Sun comes out, and we'll have a beautiful weather for the football game, and hopefully for a win here in State College as well. Well, the game won't be in State College, but the Penn State is from State College. Later on Saturday, no, no clouds showing up on the satellite, and if we zoom out, we can see why. we got this nice area of high pressure that is helping to keep our skies clear, but we do have this cold front out here towards the west, and there are a few clouds associated with that, and this cold front is part of a storm system which is up here in Canada that is hidden behind the banner. That's actually what's going to bring our rain for Sunday. But for tonight, we're forecasting the low of 50 degrees with increasing clouds, and those clouds will continue to increase throughout the day tomorrow. It will be partly the most cloudy throughout the day, but otherwise, temperatures will be pretty warm, maybe put hitting 70, and then we got that rain on the way Saturday night and into Sunday morning. So for tomorrow, we're forecasting a high of 69 degrees, maybe 70, if we can get the sun out a little bit longer than the clouds. With, but otherwise, it'll be partly cloudy skies. Then the rain comes on Sunday, and it's going to be scattered showers, and then the rain's out of here on Sunday. Maybe a few lingering showers on Monday and Tuesday, but it looks mostly dry. Otherwise, though, it'll be partly the most cloudy throughout the week, which you can see on your seven-day forecast. Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, we got clouds throughout the whole day with partly cloudy skies. Temperatures are in the six, upper 60s to 73 for your Saturday and Sunday, and then we'll drop those temperatures down into the low 50s for next week before climbing things back up to average around 60 and then a bit above average at 68 for your Friday. That's your forecast. Have a great weekend.